Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Mikhail from the podcast and to be unapologetic. And y'all, I know I realize like my eyelash is kind of like cricket, okay? But it's like really early in the morning. But anyway, that's besides the point, y'all. Let's just get back to the video. Oh, but I did want to point it out. But yeah, let's get back to the video. So basically what I wanted to talk to you guys about today was how you can use the herb mugwort. Um to better enhance your dreams and you know we're going to get into how to make the tea um how to put intentions into the tea and you know what you should be thinking about when you're drinking the tea but first let's talk about dreams okay so you know there's different ways of doing divination and divination is just when you use a certain type of tool to get divine messages that come from the divine the universe and so when i say the universe this could be anybody on your spiritual team that have your best interests and that are giving you very divine truthful messages so this can be from your spirit guides from the spirits you work with your ancestors these are divine messages that hold truth that can help you get a better understanding of things going on in your life get a better understanding of yourself um allowing you to just know things that you need to know for yourself just can range from anything but in a nutshell that is what divination is getting messages from the divine universe like whatever you know you <laughs> whatever you refer to that word it is you can use it interchangeably and so as you're going along your spiritual journey um and you know you're enhancing certain abilities or whatever you'll figure out the ones the abilities that are more of your strong suit because i do feel like you know we all are capable of tapping into all of our senses as far as like our psychic abilities and all of the clears and stuff like that but i feel like usually there's like one or two senses that um kind of i want to say trump the others but like are very more strong if that makes sense like you're stronger with that and so because you're stronger with these types of senses it's better to do divination in that type of way because i think when people think of like oh let's you know do some divination let's do like tarot whatever you know tarot even though we're all capable of reading tarot cards tarot isn't necessarily for everybody and isn't necessarily everybody strong suit you know um you know if you have a stronger sense of like okay a feeling and you know just knowing then yeah that may be more of your strong suit but if you're along your spiritual journey if you realize like okay i'm very clairvoyant uh, when it comes to images and seeing things then maybe i need to see like okay let me do divination through dream work and let me be able to interpret my own dreams and get better with getting messages along my spiritual journey so i can know what to do what to be on the lookout for through my dreams because this is what's best for me at the moment you know along my journey it, obviously if you're on this video you know you want to enhance that side of you and you're all probably you're already probably dealing with like different methods of like enhancing your dreams and getting better with that so if you're just currently on their journey of like enhancing your dreams um and doing anything within the dream state incorporating mugwort within your methods is going to be very beneficial so i got some dried mugwort right here it's like a big bag i think it's yes yeah, four ounces and i got this off of amazon um most of the herbs that i get i either get it off amazon because you can get like a big batch a lot of the times um <laughs> you can get like four ounces of herbs for like a really decent price or um, sometimes I go on Etsy. That's a really good tip. You know, if you're trying to get um, some affordable herbs and not feel like you're over spending. <laughs> I think this was like $12, I'm not sure, but mugwort. So mugwort in itself, it has really like a lot of different spiritual benefits. But when it comes to like your psychic abilities and dreaming, 
this is like a go-to herb because some of the spiritual benefits that mugwort has the and this is important to know because when you're putting intention into the herb and asking of it you need to know these things you need to know like what is your intentions when speaking over and drinking the tea so some of it again we're dealing with anything in the dream state so mugwort deals with anything in the dream state and so one thing that mugwort gives off is it's able to help you better recall your dreams which is very important in you know dream interpretation and getting messages from the divine because we all want to just wake up and remember our dreams so it's like when you think about like in the past like you know how you just wake up and you had like a really good dream or a very interesting dream and then you just can't remember anything well when you use mugwort it's going to help you with dream recall so mugwort helps with remembering your dream it helps with um making you have very intense dreams it helps with making you enhance have um dreams that are very enhanced um very like realistic dreams it also helps with like lucid dreaming um and that's really important like as you get more on your journey of like dreaming and th things of that nature you're gonna realize like being able to lucid dreams make you actually get more understanding from the dream because you know you have more of a conscious like you're more consciously awake in the dream so it just makes sense so it helps with lucid dreaming it also helps with astral projecting so if you're uh wanting to like astral project it helps with that too anything with the dream world it helps with like uh you know divination and um just your psychic abilities so that's some of the things and so when you're making this tea what you want to do i don't have a napkin maybe like a teaspoon i'll just show you how much i get be getting okay just like probably this much i don't know how much that is but maybe that's Maybe that's a, over a teaspoon. That's too much. I don't know. I just want to show y'all. But I get like a little bit. Okay. Let me can see. Of mugwort. I get about that much. Okay. And what I do. Put my right hand over my left hand. And I just pray over it. So everything that I told you about the spiritual benefits that it brings. That's what I'm kind of like praying over it for like thanking it thanking the mugwort for allowing me to be able to you know lucid dream or astral project um just everything that i name to have um dreams that are very realistic and enhanced um allow me to be able to have dream recall like that is what you're kind of you know saying as you're praying over it and so what you want to do is just get like a, a pot of water small um boiler and just put some water in there it doesn't have to be a lot and when it starts to boil that is when you want to put the mugwort in there and then i would say just let it boil for like a minute or two and then what you want to do is turn it off turn off the stove and put like the um put the lid on top of it and just let it steep so you just let it sit there for maybe like five minutes then after that what you want to do is get the cup that you're going to use like a a tea cup a coffee cup whatever you know you drink tea or whatever out of and you're going to pour you're going to get the sifter put it over the cup and then pour the water into the cup and you have the sifter there so you don't have any herbs while you're drinking the tea you don't you know drink any herbs or whatever and what i like to do is add honey to it um to make it sweet because it's going to be very bitter if you don't add the honey okay or you can add sugar but i use honey and what you want to do as you're drinking the tea you guys you want to just think about all of the intentions like I like to say like affirmations like I will have dream recall I will lucid dream you know whatever is your intentions if it's astral projecting whatever you want to do that and I like to do it maybe like an hour or two I like to drink it an hour or two before I go to bed and also um 
meditating like maybe while i'm in the bed before i actually sleep i may like just want to like do a silent meditation for five minutes um you know of course alongside a tea like if you're working on like dream interpretation interpretations and enhancing your dreams or lucid dream of course you have other methods this is just uh, a supplement um it's like a supplement to whatever else you're doing but it works okay <laughs> um and you know you just fall asleep and you let you see what happens you know but you have the intentions like it's going to happen and the thing with getting better in any aspect of like your spiritual journey things might not work the first time but don't give up like so a lot of times it takes practice um it, it takes practice and it takes you doing it a couple of times before you know your body is just trained to like automatically go into that state so don't give up the first time like if you do the mug if you drink the mugwort tea and you know you don't have any dream recall or you don't have any lucid dreaming don't give up keep being intentional because the more intentional you are the better you'll get so yeah this was my whole spill on mugwort tea and how you can incorporate it into being able to dream and have better interpretations of your dream be able to have more enhanced vivid dreams um that's just mugwort tea it works for me and you know there's a lot of different herbs outside of this that can just work for different things so if you're on your spiritual journey tea is like you know learning how to make certain teas with certain herbs can be very beneficial okay so this is just one way that you can use a herb which is my work inside of your you know to help with your dreams you guys so so you guys that is it that is all thank you so much for watching this video um if you have any questions you can leave them down below um and i'll answer them so thank you guys again